The Yeti approach is to try and help those people who are not coming through a linear academic route. Um, the people who are self-employed, the window cleaners, the people with a great idea, the artists, the creatives, um, anybody with any idea that wants to become self-employed and start their own business but hasn't gone through that academic process of college, university, business diploma and a lot of those people haven't got the support of university startup hubs or government support or grants that are available to people going through the formal routes. So the idea of Yeti was that we would get people who have already gone through that experience, people who have already started their own businesses and ask them what they needed, what support were they missing and how did they manage to succeed. So that formed our needs analysis. We have a bank full of interviews with lots of young people in Wales, the UK, in France, in Spain, in Greece. And on our website you can find an analysis of those. So we have local issues, local boundaries to entry into starting their own businesses, personal boundaries, motivation, lack of self-confidence. So once we've collected all this evidence and this data, we can then go ahead and start creating some resources to try and fill in those gaps. So we work directly with the people that we've interviewed, we work directly with young entrepreneurs to create training resources. And then we worked with those young entrepreneurs and trained them to become ambassadors for the project. So we've got training that's been co-created and developed by people who have experienced starting up a business and then including those people in the training of young people, up and coming, aspiring entrepreneurs. I think that's the great thing about the project is that it involves real life case studies, real life examples. Um, it's straight down to the, the nitty gritty. You're going to find it tough but you can succeed and here I am as living proof. Somebody from your town um, not necessarily with uh, you know amazing qualifications, with any education at all, doing it out there, making a go of it and succeeding. I think it's really inspiring for young people to see that and to have them as role models. So we recruited and trained our Yeti ambassadors and we took a group to Lille to work directly with some young people there. and. I guess we dropped them into the deep end a little bit, so we had the training, and as part of the training, we had them working directly with the young people that we're training them to work with. So at all stages of the project, the end user has been included, kind of almost like a flipped classroom. Yeah, it was a lot of fun.